The May 2020 glam bag is here and I'm going to be unboxing slash unbagging it <laughs> for you all who are going to be watching. So this is what May's glam bag looks like and I actually like it a lot. <laughs> this is such a cute color. So the first thing I'm going to be taking out is going to be that flyer that we get in every glam bag. So May's catchphrase is get that glow. And then on the back here, it just shows you the dates for add-ons when they allow us to purchase like cheap samples. So this flyer was actually different. It didn't have the products on the inside, but this time it was hacks on highlighter. So first off, it talks about powder highlighter. It tells you to use a fan brush and to sweep it across your cheekbones. Next, it talks about liquid highlighter. It tells you how to dot it on your cheekbones, your nose, Cupid's bow. And then with cream highlighter, it tells you to use your finger to tap it into your skin. So this is everything you need to know to glow. And I thought this was really nice of Ipsy. So my first product was actually in this package. I guess it's because it couldn't fit in my bag. But this one, so it actually retails at $18.50, guys. My glam bag is $12. <laughs> and I didn't get no sample brush. It is the full size. This brush is by SL Miss Glam, and it is the SS57 Blender Brush. So these bristles are actually super soft. It feels great on my fingers, and I imagine it would be good on my face, too. I really love the pink design of these brushes. The glitter is so amazing, the little pink diamonds, and then the pink bristles. And for a comparison, I'm showing you that this brush is longer than my hand. <laughs> This next product that I'm going to be pulling out is the Pearlis Matcha Green Tea and Lemon Detoxifying Charcoal Mask. And just a comparison, this sample that I'm getting is 0.5 ounces. The full size version is 1.8 ounces. So I'm getting about one third of that bottle. That costs $35. Once again, in my $12 glam bag, just saying. <laughs> Next thing, it has an 18 month expiration date, so I can save it for more than a year. Also, you could use it if you have oily, combination skin, normal, or even sensitive skin. It says that it detoxifies your pores, it clarifies, brightens, exfoliates, and purifies. So it does so many things in just this one mask. And I'm just showing you how it looks here. And from my point, it actually feels like it has those beads in it, even though I can't really see them. But I actually like how it feels because those beads usually feel really fresh on my face. And just to let y'all know, it does not smell bad. I actually like the smell. So the next product that I'm gonna be bringing out is by The Bomb Cosmetics. And it is a single shade from the Auto Bomb Day to Night palette that costs $26.50. And this shade, it expires in 12 months, so that means I can use it for a whole year. And it is in the shade Wall Street. So right now, I'm going to be zooming into it so that you can have like a better, closer look at this shade. And now I'm going to be swatching it for you. So this just went on so smooth in one swipe and it looks like a really pretty golden shade that can be used as a shadow or highlighter. So this shade is pretty portable and it has a magnetic top which I love in anything I have.
the next product I'm gonna be getting is by Pure Brazilian and it is a daily anti-frizz serum so the three ounce version of this costs seven dollars and fifty cents and i'm getting a one ounce version in my glam bag so this product has an expiration date of 12 months and it shows here that it comes with keratin acai argan oil and cocoa butter and that it can strengthen and shine your hair without frizz and it says to use it before blow drying and styling. So now I'm gonna open it for y'all so y'all can see how it looks. So I was actually not expecting this. I thought there was gonna be a pump or something, but I guess you're just supposed to like stick your finger there or maybe squeeze it to get it out. And this is what it looks like. It has a clear color, <laughs> if that even makes sense. But it looks like it should be easy to get into your hair because usually some creams are white and then like you have to keep trying and trying to make sure it's all dissolved in your hair. And this actually smells really good too. So the next product and my last product is going to be by Tarte Cosmetics and it is a H2O gloss. So I'm getting a sample of a $19 lip gloss. And it is in the shade Below Deck and it shows that it has a 6 month expiration date. So here I am, I'm going to open it for y'all. So it actually looks really creamy considering that it's dripping when I pull it out. So it looks really shiny from what I can tell. Looks like it has some different colored sparkles in it. So now I'm gonna swatch this for you. So here's what it looks like off of the first swipe. And I'm just gonna go over it like I would on my lips. So as I'm doing this, it actually feels really sticky. And I'm not sure how I would like that on my lips. I would really like the glosses to just glide on me, not like prevent me from trying to move. So I'm not sure how much I like this, but I do like the color. So these were all five products that I received in my Ipsy May Glam Bag. I was overall really happy. I always am with my Ipsy Glam Bag. Thank you for watching and for staying tuned to find out what I received. Remember to subscribe, like, and share with your friends. Comment letting me know if you like this. Bye-bye.